What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Call of Duty Modern Warfare. And today I'd like to talk about uh, one of the big issues that has been happening in Modern Warfare over the last few days. And that is a lot of players getting banned. And a lot of these players getting banned uh, for no reason. Now, back when Warzone was first released, we started seeing a lot of cheaters in game. There's still a lot of cheaters in Warzone as we speak. And of course, that's kind of what happens when you have a free-to-play game. The option for people to play, or the option for more people to play is there because it is free. Uh, of course, everything going on in the world, a lot more people are at home right now. So you have a lot of people playing, a lot of people that are cheat. And of course, that has always been a big issue on PC and PC games in general. A lot of games have cheating issues. Of course, a lot of game companies also have very good uh, anti-cheat kind of things in place where Call of Duty really didn't have anything in place right when Warzone was released, it seemed. But kind of over the last several months, they have implemented several waves of bans that have gotten rid of a lot of cheaters. And while that hasn't right, gotten rid of all the cheaters in game, still a lot of them have been uh, gotten rid of. But back a few months ago, if you guys remember, they said they were going to implement a new way where you could report players and that way they could start kind of getting more info on who was cheating and who was not cheating. And I don't know if that had anything to do with this and something just went wrong in the algorithm and it just messed up. But I told some friends back when that was kind of mentioned, I said, they're going to have a problem eventually on their hands because people are going to be able to just go in and troll some folks, get a group of folks they're playing with, report somebody from cheating because they got beat by them, they didn't like them, whatever the case may be. And also we talked about some of the things, me and my friends talked about some of the things that could kind of be a problem with this. Like I just said, I don't know what happened, but a lot of these people that have been banned over the last several days to the last week seem to be not legitimate bans. They just seem to be normal players getting banned for absolutely no reason. And I don't, like I said, I don't know if it's something wrong with the algorithm they have in place to ban cheaters and it just slipped up, messed up, whatever the case may be. But Activision has been saying on Twitter and a lot of forums they're looking into these issues, but there has been no solution yet for these players that were banned, uh, you know, for really nothing that they know that they have done in game for not cheating. Now, of course, there is some other ways you can get banned in game. Of course, if you're toxic or, or, you know, there's a lot of things besides just straight up cheating that you can get banned out of game for, uh, you know, your player name, that kind of thing. And I can understand maybe a, a small group, you know, seeing bans every time they do a ban wave, but the amount of players that have been banned uh, this time seems like something just is something is not right. It, I just can't see all of these people reporting they were banned and it actually being looked for a legitimate reason. So I, I think Activision is going to have to get on top of this pretty quickly, uh, sort out who was supposed to be banned really and who was banned unfairly, and and, and get these players back in game, get these players' accounts back on. So they can hop back in and play because if they continue to let this go for a while, they're going to have a big issue of when they do fix it, players are really not going to trust playing the game. They're going to kind of go away from it. Other players that are playing may worry about getting banned for no reason, so they're going to stop playing. There's a lot of issues this can cause, so hopefully it does get addressed and fixed quickly by Activision and Infinity Ward. Leave me a comment with your thoughts, guys. Let me know if you know anybody that got banned. I don't know anybody personally that did, but of course, like I said, you can read about all types of uh, different players from all over the world getting banned uh, on any pretty much social media or Reddit or anything like that. So like I said, leave me a comment with your thoughts. If you liked it, hit the like. If you hadn't subscribed yet, please do so. If you are a subscriber, make sure you click the bell icon up in the top right corner so you know when all my videos go live. If you have a chance to share the video, please do. It does help out the channel a lot. And be sure to check out GT Racing. They are the affiliate here on the channel and all their information is down in the description. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.